Vin Diesel's lifestyle and training today you're going to find out exactly how Vin Diesel managed to become who he is a guy in great physical shape. Well, first of all, Vin Diesel loves his mom very much. For brutal guys like him, that's normal. I remember back in the 80s, Mr. T, the dark, mohawked bumpkin from the 18, said, I'm a real mama's boy. And I pity the fools that aren't. Now Vin Diesel is ready to repeat those words. He really owes a lot to his mother. My mom always said I had to be a real fighter, a jock and generally a stand-up guy to protect my true self, the actor admits. My current appearance is one of the few ways I can prove my love to her without turning to pink snot. Vin Diesel became known for playing uncompromising tough guys. The most famous of these is Dominic Toretto, the mechanic from The Fast and the Furious. Thanks to such roles, Vin Diesel has developed a peculiar, one might say, uncomplicated reputation of a positive, but generally not very distant big guy, who, by the way, does not look like him at all real. In ordinary life, Vin Diesel is a caring, empathetic father and media guru. His army of internet fans is greater than the population of Kazakhstan, Armenia and Moldova combined. Yes, Diesel's career and success are indebted to his physical form. But is this form a typical Hollywood pacifier, artificially and temporarily created, and moreover, turned the right way to the camera lens? Of course not. His muscles don't deflate after the final day of filming. Diesel's form was not built under the empathetic guidance of a celebrity trainer. He made himself, and it wasn't an easy road. I was trying to make my way as an actor, Vin Diesel recalls, and it took money. Back then, in 1980s New York, that meant working out every day in smelly gyms and working as a bouncer in a nightclub. I looked imposing, Vin Diesel admits, it helped me a lot on the street. Vin Diesel is a fan of old-school bodybuilding, which is where he started. Today, time-honored techniques help him maintain the muscle mass levels necessary for one role or another. Over time, he added martial arts and running to his regimen, and the result is a body that's all about size and relief. When I was young, I was just trying to get bigger than everybody else, the big guy grins. Today I focus more on working out individual muscles, chiseling every muscle in every way possible to make it stand out. I usually do two very heavy sets, trying to lift maximum weight, and then switch to multi-practice work. Our hero is willing to change, no matter what it takes. When the producers of Chronicles of Riddick asked Diesel to move more gracefully on the screen, he began not only to stretch more often, but seriously interested in yoga and Pilates. Now his body is like an expensive racing car not only does it look impressive, but it also drives beautifully. A winner's attitude the reputation of a tough guy, if he has won, everyone uses it however he wants. At one time, when Diesel was persuaded to return to the set of Fast and the Furious, he set a condition, and now he is not only the performer of one of the main roles, but also the producer of the film, his own boss. However, the born leader is not necessarily the one who always gets what he wants. The real hero is also attractive, he attracts people to him. I don't want you to look at the world through rose-colored glasses, not at all. But I want you to understand that there is a way of positive energy. Vin Diesel thinks it's very important to be aware of how you yourself relate to the world around you. Are you a schmuck, a winner, a critic, dissatisfied with your circumstances, a chronic mocker, next to whom the truth is rather depressing than funny? Or would you rather be the guy who tries to see the positive side in everything you encounter in life? Such a guy has a much better chance of succeeding in life. The constant search for more and more awesomeness, working as a bouncer, and other difficult circumstances in life didn't make Vin angry or antisocial. On the contrary, as you get older, Vin Diesel explains, you don't want to punch somebody in the face so much anymore. It's much more like a friendly hug. Lifestyle Vin Diesel's different roles required a different approach to training. Choose the right type, or just change every month. Fast and Furious 5, 2011. Character. Dominic Toretta likes to swing his fists, steal cars and pummel foes with a crescent wrench. Body. You don't need any complications here, says Vin Diesel. 
Cram in all the calories you need to lift the most weight. The Chronicles of Riddick, 2004, Character Richard B. Riddick is an alien with a complex character composed entirely of muscle. Wears dark glasses and can see in the dark. Body Riddick is not from our planet, so having a beer belly is out of the question. Limit carbs and start doing yoga and stretching. The Three X's, 2002. Character Xander Cage is a psycho, curled up in extreme sports and moonlighting as an international spy. Body Cage is the most vain of all my characters, his body deserves the most attention, says Vin Diesel. Combine training with iron and all the mobility sports you manage to master. Training Program If you want to bring your torso up to the new Hollywood standard, follow this program based on Vin Diesel's personal training plan. Do three workouts a week for at least a month. Once you stretch, you can take a full breath, but then perform all five supersets consistently and without stopping. The only time you can rest is after the deadlift and the bench press, which must be no longer than a minute and a half. And then there are a couple more circuits in the same spirit, of course, without the warm-up. Warm-up in order to make training of individual muscle groups more effective, it makes sense to start from power movement that requires the effort of the whole body. This will excite the CNS more quickly and make your body pay closer attention to all further manipulations with weights. Knee Barbell Snatch with Medium Grip Grab the barbell, with a grip slightly wider than your shoulders, straighten your arms, arch your back, and slightly bend your knees. Bend down and lower the barbell's grip almost to knee level. Bend your legs with a powerful effort, rise on your toes and straighten your body. Without stopping, shrug and pull the bar along your body so that it gets over your head on straight arms. At the last moment, you can sit down under the machine by bending your knees. Straighten your legs, completing the movement. Gently return the barbell to the starting position and repeat. Do three sets of five repetitions, resting for one minute between sets. Superset 1, deltoids dumbbell press, standing press, alternating. Stand up straight, back straight, knees slightly bent. Lift the dumbbells above your head, turning the bars in a line. Slowly lower your left arm to your shoulder, return to the position, and repeat with the other arm. Do 6 to 8 repetitions with each arm and immediately move on to the next exercise. Isometric abductions with a partner drop the dumbbells, straighten your arms and spread them apart. Ask your partner to put pressure on your forearms and resist his attempts to press your arms against your body for 10 seconds. That's it, the approach is over. Superset 2, Breasts Isometric Bench Press Lie down on an inclined bench positioned in a power frame. Place the safety rests in the middle of the amplitude of the future bench press. Grasp the empty bar with a wide grip and lower it to the top of your chest. Now, forcefully straighten your arms and rest them on the safety bars. Press the bar as hard as you can for exactly 10 seconds. Immediately move on to the next exercise. Bench press you can move to the incline bench, or you can stay here, just take away the safety and add weight to the barbell. Now take the barbell off the racks and straighten your arms. Lower the bar to the top of your chest and return to the same position. Do 6 to 8 repetitions. Superset 3, breasts isometric bench press place two step platforms a little wider than your shoulders on the floor. Get a supine support hands on the platforms, feet together. Without arching your back, lower yourself, hold that position for 10 seconds and move on to the next exercise. Dumbbell press on a horizontal bench lie on a bench with your feet shoulder width apart and dumbbells in your hands. Place the shells on each side of your chest with the bars in a single line. Squeeze the dumbbells up, bringing them together, and return to the position. Do 8 to 12 repetitions. Superset 4, Arms. Isodynamic Biceps Lift Take dumbbells in your hands, stand up straight, slightly bend your legs at the knees. Turn your palms out toward you and bend your arms at the elbows to a right angle. Leave your left hand in place and lower your right hand. Return to the starting position and repeat with the other arm get one repetition. 
Do 8 to 12 repetitions and go straight to the next exercise. Isodynamic triceps extensions lift dumbbells above your head and bend your arms at the elbows. Straighten your right arm, return to a similar position, and repeat with the other arm this will be one rep. Do 8 to 12 repetitions. Superset 5, Arms Delayed Hammers. Grab dumbbells in your hands with palms facing inward. Put your feet hip width apart, straighten up. Bend your right arm at the elbow until the dumbbell touches your shoulder. Now gently lower the dumbbell until the angle between your forearm and shoulder is 90 degrees. Hold for a two second pause, return to the position and repeat the same thing with the other arm. Do 8 to 12 repetitions for each arm.